Hello, I'm Kenichi Ishikawa from the University of Tokyo. When irradiated by intense laser pulses, atoms and molecules exhibit extremely nonlinear and interesting behavior, such as tunneling ionization and high harmonic generation. These phenomena are too complicated to be interpreted only by means of experiments. So in my lab, we are developing quantum mechanical first principle simulations to reveal how electrons move in atoms and molecules under intense laser pulses and attosecond pulses. Our research will ultimately lead to technology to observe and manipulate electronic motion. As my research is not bound to lab equipment, I often visit researchers in and outside Japan for joint research. Unlike printed technical books, which are heavy and hard to carry with me, e-books are handy and I can save many of them at the same time on my iPad. One day during a visit to one of my longtime collaborators at Tohoku University, I came up with an idea in the course of our discussion. Using e-books I had brought, I could quickly look up related theories and formulas, and we created a new theory and ran simulations. Thanks to my e-books, there was no need to interrupt the discussion and we could quickly study the problem together. While talking with other researchers at conferences, we often had to suspend our discussion to consult references in my office the next day and typically ended up forgetting to do so. But now I can consult e-books on the spot, allowing me to turn a spontaneous idea into an interesting study and then into an achievement. But I must also say, printed books have their own advantages. A book you casually pick up may give you unexpected inspiration. You can flip back and forth through the pages of a book or put two books side by side and compare their contents. I hope these advantages will someday be incorporated in e-books through further software improvements.